Hello and uh, welcome everyone. Welcome to my another playlist where I will be covering uh, the basics of Docker, like uh, how to create a Docker container, Docker file, how to build the Docker file to create the containers, all the basic things which a developer need to learn to work with the Docker in the development environment. Okay, so myself Tarun, I'm a developer, trainer, publisher, and uh, I teach online. Like uh, I have a YouTube channel, this YouTube channel from where I am uh, publishing a lot of free videos ok so in this particular course this course is divided into the six sections section 1 we will talk about the setup and installation section 2 we will talk about the containers uh, virtualized uh, first we will talk about what is VMs virtual machines and what is the containers we'll, then we will talk about containerization how it is different from the, the earlier way of doing the virtualization then a docker daemon process, docker architecture then uh, we, will, we will build the docker image, we will create the containers and we will also take a look on docker registry uh, docker hub, how it is uh, playing the role for pulling the docker images and pushing the docker images then our last stage will be we should be able to write docker compose file because that is going to be useful for the developers to set up the development environment where they need MySQL, Redis, Node.js, uh, maybe RabbitMQ. So all those th different uh, applications can run on different containers and they can talk to each other. And you don't need to do a manual installation of all these softwares. You just need to have everything inside a single Docker Compose file and same Docker Compose you can share with your friends. So he can also have the same kind of environment within 5 minutes. Okay, so what you need to have, you need to have basic uh, HTML knowledge. I will say just you should have, you can be from any development environment, either Java, JavaScript, .NET, it doesn't matter. Uh, Docker is just purely about that you should at least be a developer to understand the command, understand the Linux command, understand the basic terminology and all. And uh, this is the extra information that this is the pattern we will be covering docker commands, docker run, advanced docker run feature, docker images, creating new images, docker compose and the docker networking. Okay, so I think uh, let's get started from the first video where we will uh, do the setup and installation of docker.